Yes, so the construction of the what's the name of this road? Kaswa to Winneba Road is ongoing and it's so nice. My assistant was just saying that oh, since election year is coming, they are coming to fix the road because. The yes, year is coming back. I think I want to speak for the government for once. The road is being fixed now, but the project did not start now. Okay, so when you start an engineering project, you need to decide to do the project, commission uh, consultants to do feasibility studies, and then they do a design. Okay, and then they open it up for procurement for contractors to bid, then you mobilize, then you come and set the path, okay, you set where the road will be, and then you begin construction. This thing can take more than four years. Once a political party should stay in power, maybe for four or maybe eight years. So some of these projects could have started four or six years ago, but they are now actually hitting the road, okay. So that's the issue about road construction. That usually we don't understand when we are young, but it's a thing we should actually look at. It takes time for it to hit the ground, okay? But the second thing is this project is really massive. The stretch of road is long. The stretch is so long, and I can see that they are investing heavily into equipment. Yes, they want to finish before election. <laughs> so you realize that they'll be doing a lot more. They work at day, they work at night, they work during the weekends, which is impressive, but I think it's nice. I was wanted to talk about engineering, so they are doing a lot of cutting on the hills and filling on the valleys. Okay, because this is a dual carriage, a very very high speed, so they have to. There shouldn't be sharp rises, okay, or deep steeps. Okay, the road has to be in a way that you can watch very far while driving because you will be driving very fast. I believe that is very interesting. I like that. And the stones can actually be used for the construction subsequently. Kudos to Akufado and his team. This is nice, okay? And then the other thing also that I realized the stones they can utilize in the ground stabilization. So I realized that the ground, some of them is very rocky, that's great, but some of them is clay, which uh, retains water, which is not good for construction, okay? And then the loam soil, which may also not be good, sand is not good. So they are investing a lot of energy into ground, ground stabilization so that the road can actually last pretty long. And I think it's great. So it's a good job. Now, Kassan uh, to Winneba will be shut up when it's done. Stay tuned. Share with the next two months. Let's have a conversation.